Welcome to our deep dive into audio processing tools. Today, we're tackling a question that many audio engineers and data scientists often ponder. Which tool can I trust? Our viewer is exploring two popular libraries, Librosa and Caldi, to create data sets for visualizing filter bank energies from an audio file. Let's break down the viewer's challenge. They are testing Librosa and Caldi to extract and visualize 40 filter bank energies from an audio file. However, they are facing discrepancies in the outputs and are unsure which tool provides the most reliable results. Welcome back to another tech video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. In this video, we'll explore how to determine which tool to trust for extracting filter bank energies from audio files. We'll compare two popular libraries, Librosa and Caldi. First, let's look at the configuration used in Caldi for extracting filter bank energies. This configuration includes settings like sample frequency and the number of melbins. Next, we will visualize the extracted data using Librosa. The code snippet here shows how to load an audio file and create a MEL spectrogram. After visualizing the data, we notice that both tools produce similar plots, but the energy ranges differ significantly. Caldi shows a range from 9.8 to 22.7, while Librosa ranges from 984.7 to matter 4.7. Finally, to ensure consistency in our plots, we need to normalize the data before visualization. This step is crucial for comparing outputs from both tools effectively. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The solution involves correcting the normalization process. Instead of using a direct transformation, you should apply normalization with specific minimum and maximum values. And that's it, guys. I hope we've gone through the question and found that solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.